Hello everyone and welcome back to our Mare Nostrum achievement run. We are considering piecing out. Actually, oh, I need my I need my diplomat back, so we'll just wait until we get call for peace. And that can be our trigger. So we're trying to prevent some of these nations from wanting to join the coalition. Prestige is more oppressing. Prestige will get us increased aggressive expansion reduction. Revert over to admin. Florence finished, so let's have a look at the peace out deal again. Look all this, who joins? <sighs> no longer Florence. You know what we're working on? Venice. Venice is gone, but we'll leave it for another week or two. Provence we have a peace with. England we have a peace with. Burgundy we have a peace with. Aragon we'll have a peace with. Provence we have a peace with. Portugal. Now, Luca, Mantua, Lier. None of those are really important. And at the end of this year, a lot of those ones at the bottom, everyone after what? No, only Aachen and Palatinate run out, not Memigan. Maybe we go do Liège. Give Venice like three more months. There. Now let's have another look. So Lorraine, who I think we have a long piece with still, yes. We have Portugal, Baden, um, Alsace. Who do we pick in Alsace? Parma. Why not Parma? Um, no. I'm sorry. It depends on where you go. Let you exist, but if you try to walk towards where I'm keeping claims, then I'll have to kill you. Like, you can take this, and you can take down here. I'll retake this. As long as you take down here, I don't mind. See, that's perfect. Now I can move here. And we try to piece out. Okay. We would also like... War reps. And money. Thank you. Okay. Peace. Everywhere that is new. Up autonomy. Consider our fort situation. I don't know that we need either of these two. So these two are kind of better than we can get rid of these two. That being said, this one is in... no. No. Get rid of... Goodbye. Well, beautiful. People can land here, but then they can't really get very far. I suppose they can get up to here, and then here. Now, we want to core all of this. Lost. Take too long. And let's check. Our aggressive expansion map mode. Now we just sit and wait. I 
actually I might as well fabricate the next batch against here, eh? One, two, five. some new marketplaces. One. Everywhere that wants a marketplace. Two. Three. Four. Five. There we go. That does it for the moment. Genoa like us enough not to join. We will give them like three more months so that it stays that way. Oh, they're already at max. Derp. Liege like us enough not to join. Live them for a couple more months so they stay that way. Who has joined? Carrara, you're pretty big. You're worth getting rid of. Okay, take another look at our state's map mode. We're going to consider adding these to a state after. Add Catalonia and Aragon. Oh, our boats. Uh, where does our navy live now? Our navy lives in Provence. Now, these guys trade in Bordeaux. These guys hunt pirates in Genoa. And you are both set to go home at war. Super duper awkward if they lose their union with Naples. For them. In fact, how much aggressive exp eh, not enough. Who cares? Uh ah, shall I'll leave it for two more months. Stop with Liege. One. There. They're still busy in their war with England, so they can't coalition us. Who can, or has, that we want to get rid of? Derps. Oh, that one's the best for the moment. Gain base tax. We will have a look at... We will have a look at now these again. We can coming up. Fine with that. Fine with that. Oof. Group. Group. Got thirteen four. Cross. And I need one more horsey. But 
Has our force limit increased? Yes, it has. We can support that. We get one more horse. And maybe 16. Yeah, that looks lovely. And even if we lose the land force limit guy, it doesn't matter. Okay, speed up again. Now, what can we simply call that one that we couldn't afford to? All those marketplaces finished, so let's see what that does for our trade. Five. Ooh, a six three zero. That's not great for military, but it is lovely for coring. Goes to oh, I was looking at the wrong one, I was looking at production. Oh well. Maybe add a comment telling me what was what was improved. There we go, we can get rid of Ferrara. They stay out. They wouldn't stay out, so it's not worth doing. About Palmer. They also wouldn't stay out. I need to wait a little bit longer. We can our uh, missions. Fly with the Pope. Actually never gonna happen, so you know what, let's get rid of it. I would like to do the same in case we can get a PU. I can probably give up everything that I have in Brittany, yes. They couldn't coalition us, so goodbye. get someone from my dynasty. Good enough. New mission. Turn Brittany to its proper alliance, uh, allegiance. We'll be doing that, don't worry. Our manpower reserves need to cover. Recover. That's probably the one because we've got to wait a while before any of this aggressive expansion is going to go away. Now we're nearly at... Here we go. New year. Let's have a look. Are you at 49 or less? No. Are you at 49 or less? Also no. Are you at 49 or less? No. You? No. You? No. You? Yes. Get rid of him. Out of 
the coalition. Out of my alliance. You? Yes. And you. Okay, so let's pivot over to getting these little Slabian minions out. Burgundy gained Calais. Good for them. Gain inflation. Now, those cores finish. We could make them a state. Everything that's in this Genoa node added. Now the clergy want some more. Well, let's have a look. That one and this one are both pretty good for the clergy. But let's see trade goods map mode. Places that produce grain. Already got clergy. Bourgeoisie, which makes no sense. They're disloyal, so I can't do anything about that at the moment. You've got grain. You've got nobility. You've got clergy. You don't have clergy. Clergy. Problem solved. Now. Other than this, we want to improve with our two allies. Yep, our claims end in Brittany. That's okay. Oh, no. Brittany's claiming on us ended, maybe? Yeah, because they would have gotten one against Provence. Probably. Although that probably means that mine against his are about to expire as well. its own accord. And this zone. That's not very nice. Ew, these guys are about to leave. They get up to 60, they should turn... Oh. There we go. Who's next? Ferrara? Nope. Yeah, that's a bit more significant. Get rid of Sienna. Portugal. No, not Portugal either. Well, by the time we've improved, I think we'll be able to get rid of Mantua too. Yes, partner, we don't want you rejoining against us. Up. 
our corruption fighting to maximum. There goes Kara. Sienna. Prestige. Austria, no, it's just you. That's a bit of a worry. Where are my transports? Let's go grab my army. just returned them to... I don't mind them doing the Boleres so much. That counts as the Tunis node. Woo. Yeah, that's perfect. Let's briefly up our army maintenance so that they actually reinforce. And have a look at who we can get out. And if they would stay out... Do I want to be at war with Florence? Probably not. Our Mantua. Still won't. Who else is there? Luca! No. No. I'm not eating you yet. <clears throat> but I still need you not to want to coalition me. Speaking of which, how are we doing? Second wave, because I don't mind if Burgundy joins. Need about 20 years. Silly. Still got a ways to improve with Austria. Let's have a look around. Leicester, Lannister is doing okay. So is Kildare. The other three, not much. Poland have eaten Mazovia. They've mostly eaten the Teutonic Order. Muscovy didn't really do much to Novgorod. Sweden is still trapped as a And that's about it of interest. Bohemia integrated. Ottomans have allowed Byzantium to exist, which seems odd. I could go vassalize them and then go against the Ottomans, because I they're not worth any real aggressive expansion. Hmm. You'd want to at least be the same tech as them. And now, now that they've hit tech 5, they get units with 5 pips to my 3, so it's just an absolute... They give you, they give Westerners an absolute tr stomping from now, especially at tech 5. Uh, 
up until about tech 19 I think they still have better units. You've got to be ahead of time on them. Like you've got to be teching up before them in order for them to not have uh, an advantage militarily. Uh, oh, who was that? Luca and Portugal. Uh, we can still get rid of the Pope and we can still get rid of Baden. Austria are nearly finished, and we'll, after that we'll send them to Castile. Actually, we might send to Castile now. And then when Austria... No, England join a coalition against us. Well, tough luck. I don't care. down. Oops. And have a look at what buildings we can build, because we've probably... Oh no, we're still still waiting to take this one. Now we can see what, what we can build that's worth it. Four. Six. Two, six. Two, three. That'll have to do. Complete. Fabricate the next wave against Aragon. to draw them into smush burgundy like we do so let's check out how that would work not that I want to yet I need to let some more aggressive expansion come down but I just want to know would it be possible the answer is mostly yes except for Castile's debt Two rivals who are never going to leave, and the Pope, who might one day, except allied to. No, get over it, maybe. No. Hi. Who else can we play the Thrones game with? Serbia and Holt, Byzantium and Wallachia. Ooh, Byzantium is 55 years old. inherited. Oh yes. Outright suddenly own them. Let's hope that happens. Yeah, you can ask for money. Uh, nothing else worth doing. What can we do? We can start spending these down. What else? What else? What else? Might be worth it to try... No, Austria hates you. Seeing who we can get as another big ally. Like we could try for Muscovy. Who hates Muscovy? Just Poland. We could try for Denmark. Oh, they rival us. 
Well, I'll have a look around during the break. Thank you for watching. This has been The Blobber with our Mare Nostrum achievement run. For the first 16 years, we haven't done too badly. We ejected England, we've eaten Provence, except for the bit that's in the HRE, which we don't want, and we've taken a nice bite out of Aragon. I hope you've enjoyed watching, and we'll join us again soon. Bye-bye.